Hi everyone, Sharon Brown here with day 15 of my birthday month long celebration and I'm celebrating by giving something away every day. Today what I'm giving is a technique for dealing with anger because you may know this, you may not, but unresolved anger, holding on to that feeling, one of the things that it can do is it, in the long term it can contribute to heart disease. That's not cool. Um, another thing anger can do is it can interfere with your digestion. And so if you're holding on to this negative feeling, you know, when you, when you're eating, your body is not able to maximize on extracting the nutrients to serve you well. And so that's not good either. Uh, the other thing about anger is at the end of the day, if you really are honest with yourself and you dissect why you're angry about something, chances are it's something that's out of your control anyway. So why hold on to that negativity? Why allow all of that to enter into your organs when you have no control over it? So here, here, here's my story with anger. I, <laughs> I had an anger problem. Yes, I did. And um, I would fly off the handle very quickly. And it's, it's not until uh, my son was around toddler stage when I realized this is not good because what kind of example am I setting for him? I need to, I need to, I need to do something about this. And so around that time, not, not long after, I remember um, being in my car and I was upset. I was a teacher at the time and I had just left a meeting with my principal. And she made a decision that I did not like. Mm. I did not like it. And I was in the car and I was in that parking lot and I was fussing, fussing at the principal who's still in her office in my car. And I said, watch, this is what I said to myself, watch, watch, five years from now, she's going to regret. And then I heard myself and I said, really, Sharon? Five years from now, you're going to still be holding on to this? I thought about it and I said, mm -mm, this is too trivial to still be thinking about five years from now. So then I said, okay, how about one year from now? And I was like, mm, no. And I said, okay, how about one month from now? And I was like, mm, no. And I said, okay, how about one week from now? And she said, no. I said, Sharon, if you're not going to be upset about this five years from now, one year from now, one month from now, one week from now, then why be upset about it now? And in that moment, I let it go. I saw her perspective. I didn't agree with it, but I didn't hold on to that feeling. And then I started to talk to myself about why was I holding on to that? And I realized it's because I wanted control. So that's the technique that I'm offering you to deal with anger, to ask yourself, what's your time limit on holding on to this negative emotion? And once you realize that there is a time limit, then ask yourself, if there is a time limit, then why hold on to it now? And then once you get yourself to let that go, the next thing is to examine what you're trying to control and embrace the fact that you can't control it. So that's it. That's my giving for today. A technique for releasing anger because you don't want in the long run you end up with heart disease because you're holding on to negative emotions about things you can't control, right? Yeah, so that's it. Uh, let's see. Oh, there is still <laughs> a few hours remaining to register for my class. I found this out. You can still register online. Tomorrow we have our first live group coaching session. Um, there'll be six hours of that for the next three weeks, along with access to me for the next three weeks, every day, uh, tips, tools, resources to help you balance your personal and your professional life. Um, so you can come to a place of harmony, um, healing your body and your mind so that you can fully live out your purpose with joy and vitality. So I'll put the link to that class down below. One quick thing though, you'll have to register as a student of the college first because it is held at a college. But once you do that, you'll be fine. You go in and you just register for the class. I'll put the directions below so you'll have all that. So that's it for day 15. And um, hey, let that anger go. It's not worth it. See you tomorrow.